Hey, what's up, Rochester and all over the world tonight? It is your girl, it's Angela Speranza. We are here on this Saturday. It is so beautiful out. It is one minute till 10 p.m. No copyright if you hear my music in the background. Just feeling real good on this Saturday night. So gonna make it short and quick tonight. So viewers are writing in. Must be 18 years of age because I have a lot that I wanna say. A viewer had wrote to me and he's in a relationship where he took his long distance back after five years and things are not good. And he wanted some advice. So, you know me, I tell him and she's rude to him. She's obnoxious. She talks shit. When he goes to speak, she interrupts him. When he talks about anything in his life or about himself, she puts him down. This works for men, women, if you're gay, straight, married, it doesn't matter. Rewind my video and just pay attention. Those are the first signs of abuse. When you take your ex back, no matter who it is, man, woman, when they treat you like that, they're talking to somebody else. They left the door open. They're occupied. When you're not around, they're talking and texting. And when you're with them, they're either pissed off because they want to talk and text that person or something happens, or they're just not feeling you. It's about attraction. If you are not appealing to that person that you are with, they are going to start treating you funny. That's like the number one rule. Like, keep yourself together. If you want a long, rela long relationship, keep yourself together. <laughs> Women, if you are watching this, you know, the hair, the makeup, the workout, the eating, take care of yourself. A man, if you're watching this, you know what you have to do. I don't have to explain much to you. You guys are natural. You guys go for what you want. You are hunters. So there you go. So the next question is, so, but let me, let me just answer one more thing to that one. Do not take that. She's playing you. That's it. She's playing you. Say less. So the next question that I would say tonight in Rochester, New York, I am Angela Spurs. I am the love coach of Rochester and all over the world. It is a beautiful, nice night. Hope everyone is with that special someone they love and hope everyone is being safe. So the next question that I will answer tonight, it was from another guy. I love getting messages from guys because they, they have feelings too and your feelings matter. So he said that whenever he is with his chick, that's the way he rephrased her, the person he cares about, she's always talking shit. She's always questioning him. She's always thinking that he's talking to other girls. Motherfucker, you are giving off signs that you are talking to other bitches. That's it. Like if you're with her and you guys are in the car, an example, pay attention. And she's talking to you and your head is looking another way at a chick, any chick. She could be ugly as fuck. And you're sitting there staring at her or her body or whatever. She's going to get mad. This looks for men, women. If you're gay, straight, you're married, it doesn't matter. Rewind my video. I'm not going to say that anymore for the night, but it works for both sides. This was so good. I'm trying to get it all out without messing up. I get so comfortable with my audience that it's just, it just comes out. Must be 18 years of age because I don't give a fuck. So that's it they're cheating that's a form of cheating it works for men or women if you are driving and you are male and you catch your woman doing that and another man staring him up and down and he's not even fucking paying attention he's just outside or in a store or whatever she's she's got the eye out she's cheating on you straight like that a man straight like that they're cheating on you because if they're with someone they like and they are focused on and they are interested in they are not going to look elsewhere for anything, no matter what. You are going to be important. You're going to be their conversation. And that's all they're going to care about at that time. So next question. This woman wrote in to me and she wanted to know that why is that she gets with her man and he always smells like he's been partying? And I said, well, what do you mean by that? 
and she said that he smells like liquor and weed and cigarettes and perfume. And I said, well, I never get tired of answering these questions and there's always going to be a new response. And I said, that's because he was chilling with somebody and you were his last resort. Straight like that. That works for men, women. That's it. You were a last resort. I am Angela Spreads. I am the love coach of Rochester and all over the world. 585-296-1334. This is the regular number. You can reach me at. No question is ever silly. I will always answer it. If I don't get back to you right away, it's because I'm talking to somebody else or trying to help them out. But I always get back to my viewers and subscribers. So... Another question that I will answer tonight and then I'm going to cut it short because I want to enjoy the rest of my evening is that when you are with that special person, and this is from another woman, they should not make you feel any type of way. If a person cares about you, they will say it, they will act it, and they will show it. If they are, are unhappy you will get it in the first vibe of them talking to you in the first vibe of their texts and that's it that's all you need to know after that and it won't be a good feeling i am angela spranz i am the love coach of rochester and it was just a quick one tonight i just wanted to get these out and you come first good night